Uh, Microsoft intends to keep Call of Duty on PlayStation. Yes. He says that uh, in a podcast, he's like, we're not taking Call of Duty away from PlayStation. And then he continues to say, as long as there's a PlayStation out there to ship to, our intent is that we will continue to ship Call of Duty to PlayStation. I've never, ever said the opposite to that. I've always said, yes, there will be Call of Duty on PlayStation. What I've said is it's going to be Warzone. It will be Warzone. The free to play, not Warzone. Is that what it's called? Yeah, you, yeah, Warzone. You were saying there will Warzone. always be Call of Duty on there. It'll be like Call of Duty Warzone, free to play, monetized. Yes, PlayStation, no problem. But there will be a day where Modern Warfare Four is not on PlayStation. Could be. That's what I say. That's my take on it. That's he your hot take. Say, he doesn't say <laughs> like he doesn't say single player Call of Duty. He, 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 or he anything doesn't like say that. single player Call of Duty. He just says Call of Duty. He does like just that say could mean anything. Like we, oh yeah, Call of Duty's on PlayStation. We released our Call of Duty app that lets you look at Call of Duty videos. It's on PlayStation. <laughs> like these, he's a businessman, and they're always Weasley like this. Yeah. So this is like they did the same thing with um, oh, what was something about CD Projekt Red? They said something very similar. Like technically, we're correct. <laughs> So that's exactly what it's going to be, in my opinion. In your opinion, yep. I'm you, complete opposite. I say they continue to ship to PlayStation full uh, games. I guess so. But, you know, that's just two men opinions. Yeah, exactly. Leave a I comment just, down below and let us know what yeah, you think. Yeah, let us know what you think. But, like, I, I, you don't spend that much money to buy Activision to not get people to buy the Xbox. But they're losing $200 on every Xbox anyway. Yeah, but it's not about about that. Okay. Xbox ecosystem. Yes. Is what I mean. I know. I know. So if they can get people to buy an Xbox to play Modern Warfare 4 by keeping Battlezone, the inferior product on PlayStation, they will totally do that. And it is an inferior product. Yes. (laughs) Exactly. So I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Or they could be just using it as a bargaining chip. Like, oh, well, I we wanted to leave Call of Duty on PlayStation, but they won't let us put Game Pass on there. Like, <laughs> they just won't let us do it. So, like, okay. No, Sorry, no. we can't do it. <laughs> they won't let us do it. That's actually a pretty good bargaining chip, I would I would imagine. Well, like, yeah. You, you can have all the... Go, oh, yeah, we'll publish our games on your, yeah. on your console, yeah. but you have to have Game Pass. Yeah. <laughs> that won't work. <laughs> <laughs> no, it sure won't. They won't do it, but like... <laughs> That's how they could spin it. Like we want to do it. Let's how. But think about when it was crossplay. Everyone was like, "We want to do crossplay," but Sony won't let us do it. They <laughs> yeah. just won't let us do it. So, who knows? <laughs> yeah, they're businessmen. That's the way they weasel out of it. It's Technically, true. I didn't say Call of Duty Modern Warfare <laughs> Four. You've got Call of Duty Mobile. So I said Call of Duty. <laughs> so who knows, right? But yeah. Yeah, anyways. Or, again, okay, maybe it's not even that. Maybe it is another thing. Six months on the Xbox. Then it comes out on PlayStation. That's still on PlayStation. You know? So, could be anything. Yeah, it could be anything. We'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. Yeah. 